Hi, I'm Ayo Tunde, Balogu and Hazer Channel's TV Evening News Recap for July the 20th, 2020. The Acting Managing Director of the Niger Delta Development Commission, Professor Daniel Ponde, appeared to have slumped as the House of Representatives Committee on NDDC grilled him. The committee is in its fourth day of public hearing as it investigates alleged financial misappropriation at the agency. The Minister of Niger Delta Affairs, Senator Gotsu Lapabio, has said most contracts for the Niger Delta Development Commission are awarded to National Assembly members. The Minister made the comments today while being grilled by members of the House of Representatives Committee on the NDDC in a public hearing. To security, the Inspector General of Police, Mr. Mohamed Ademo, is asking police officers to desist from unprofessional acts as officers caught violating the law will be held accountable. Speaking in Abuja at the decoration ceremony of newly promoted senior officers, Mr. Adamo reaffirms the commitment of the police in addressing current and emerging internal security threats in the country. On the international scene, Britain has secured access to 90 million doses of potential coronavirus vaccines in deals with biotech firms BioNTech, Pfizer and Valneva. According to British Secretary Alec Sharma, Britain will now have access to three different types of vaccines being developed domestically and around the world. And in sports, the Ballon d'Or will not be awarded this year owing to the extraordinary conditions created by the COVID-19 pandemic. And that's according to the organizers, France Football. It will be the first time the trophy given for the world's best men's footballer has not been awarded since Englishman Stanley Matthews won the inaugural edition back in 1956. And that's your news recap for today. Join us tomorrow for fresh updates. I'm Ayo Tunde. Many thanks for watching.